All Recipes member Mandy says this best meatloaf I've ever made is simple and simply delicious, adding it was very moist and a keeper for the recipe box. We'll start by preheating the oven to 350 degrees Fahrenheit. Then add one tablespoon of butter to a skillet over medium heat and melt. To the melted butter, add a quarter cup of minced yellow onion and two minced garlic cloves. Cook until the onion is tender, about five minutes. Remove from heat and season with one and a half teaspoons of salt and one and a half teaspoons of freshly ground black pepper. Next, add the vegetables to two pounds of extra lean ground beef in a large mixing bowl. You can use ground turkey or chicken here instead if you wish. We'll also add three slices of toasted and crumbled bread, seven crushed buttery round crackers, one lightly beaten egg, and three and a half tablespoons of sour cream. If you wish, try a cup of Italian seasoned breadcrumbs in place of bread. Mix this together and then add one and a half tablespoons of Worcestershire sauce and half of a 15 ounce can of tomato sauce. Now gradually add a quarter cup of milk, if needed, until the meatloaf mixture is moist but not soggy. Transfer the meatloaf mixture to a 5 by 9 inch loaf pan and bake uncovered in a preheated oven for 40 minutes. Then increase the oven temperature to 400 degrees Fahrenheit and bake until the internal temperature reaches 160 degrees Fahrenheit, about 15 more minutes. Now combine the other half of the can of tomato sauce with 3 tablespoons of ketchup and pour over the meatloaf. Bake for 10 more minutes. All Recipes member Jojo comments, my whole family said this was the best meatloaf I've ever made. So I'm thinking you titled the recipe perfectly. We'll make this again.